in order to be a successful major league baseball better, you need to mix in some calculated risks on plus money winners. And I've given you three of those over the last week or so. And uh, I got a fourth one today. And uh, again, folks, I mean, you just don't throw out plus money winners for the heck of it. But like I said, the key words that I just mentioned in my previous statement is calculated risk. And I've done a good job of doing that for you over the last week or so. And uh, as a matter of fact, yesterday on Wager Talk Today show with uh, Prez and in, in, uh, Teddy Covers, I gave you a plus money winner. Um, and on the Milwaukee Brewers, minus one and a half, plus 130. And I got a similar pick in Major League Baseball today that's going to make you uh, give you a nice return on investment. Because remember, folks, that's the most important thing when it comes to Major League Baseball betting uh, in, in regards to usually you look at win loss percentage, but you want to be making money on, on your investment. So uh, again, we'll get to that in just a bit real quickly. Again, I mentioned yesterday 2-0 and on Wager Talk today. As a matter of fact, is I had not only Milwaukee minus 1.5 at plus 130, I also had the Baltimore Orioles and the L.A. Dodgers game uh, to go over the total of 8.5, and, a half, and uh, that game easily went oh, surpassed the number. And so that makes me 10-5 and five over the last week or so at, right here with my free pick videos at Wager Talk. Uh, TV. So, folks, again, approaching 60% once again since mid March when I started here at Wager Talk TV. And uh, I don't want to start on my forehead, but I do want you to give me a like. It would go a long way. Hit that like button, folks. It's a small token of appreciation for the time, work, and effort I put into bringing you a quality podcast. Also, folks, um, if you have not subscribed to our YouTube channel, please take a second to do so. Uh, it's absolutely free. And uh, go into your YouTube settings and click on the alert notification bell for Wager Talk TV. And you'll be notified immediately upon any of our world-class sports betting experts putting material up here on Wager Talk uh, TV. All right, let's get to the meat and potatoes. I'm going to be talking about Kansas City at Houston in Major League Baseball today. It'll be Brady Singer on the mound for the Kansas City Royals. It'll be Hunter Brown for the Houston Astros. Uh, slated 8, 10 p.m. Eastern time start. Right now, the Houston Astros are up to a minus 160 money line home favorite in this game. And the total, uh, which is very unusual, uh, I'm looking at anywhere from 7.5 at DraftKings to 8 at Bet Online and 8.5 at Caesars. And I'm not going to touch the total, but I will be looking at the side here. And uh, Brady Singer his last four starts, a 623 ERA and a 175 whip, folks, that qualifies as bad form. His ERA, as a matter of fact, is over a run higher compared to, uh, on the road, I should say, compared to home. And also, uh, during the day, in, uh, during the night in, in, uh, versus during the day. So, again, to clarify that, make that clearer, uh, his ERA is over a run higher uh, on the road than at home and at night compared to uh, during the day. Houston roster right now uh, against Br Brady Singer, they've had a lot of experience going against Singer, and they've had a lot of success. Uh, the current roster right now is a career 51 for 139 against Singer. That's good for a 367 batting average uh, and also a 401 on base percentage and a 919 OPS. So they've had a lot of success against Brady Singer, uh, adding uh, additional value to uh, my pick today because uh, I am going to be looking at the Houston Astros on the run line. Kansas City bullpen, um, they haven't been horrible, but a 459 ERA since uh, August the 1st also is a, uh, dominating as well. Uh, Hunter Brown, his last four starts, a 185 ERA and 095 whip. Folks, that qualifies as excellent form. His ERA, uh, similar to uh, Brady Singer, but on the opposite side of the spectrum, his ERA is over three runs lower at night compared to during the day. So uh, something to keep in mind there. Uh, the worst start of the season Hunter Brown had was against Kansas City. He was absolutely shelled in that outing. But you go back to when that was, it goes all the way back to April the 10th, 
And uh, he was in the midst of uh, probably his worst stretch in his young Major League Baseball career as he started the season awful slow. He's obviously got his uh, act together, and, you know, and that's indicative of uh, his last four starts being in excellent form. The Houston bullpen's been lights out since August the 1st, a uh, 283 ERA and a 1.11 whip, and opponents have just hit, uh, just have a 186 team batting average against Houston relievers over that course of time. I'm going to go with the Houston Astros, minus one and a half, at, mo at money line odds of plus 137 over the Kansas City Royals. No guts, no glory, folks. Houston minus one and a half, plus 137 over Kansas City. Friendly reminder, college football begins today, Thursday. Um, well, I should say week one begins today, uh, Thursday, August the 29th. And uh, my college football last year finished on a 10 and 3 and 62 and 42 runs. And uh, that 62 and 42 run to finish the season last year in college football produced a net profit of $4,006 uh, when you grade it by $100 per unit, which we do over at uh, Wager Talk. So great finish to the college football season. Finished number two overall in college football. Finished number two uh, in college football and NFL regarding money earned at Wager Talk. So a lot of reasons to invest in with me in terms of annual packages and, and football, college football annual package, 529. Uh, college football NFL combined, just 799. It's uh, uh, not a big investment to make a lot of money. So uh, you could find uh, my subscription plans at wt.buzz slash RB. Nice special going on as well right now for all of us over at Wager Talk. Uh, you three weeks for the price of two. Uh, you'll get 21 days of all access pass. That means all sports, football, baseball, etc., for just $198. That's a $99 savings, and that amounts to less than $10 per day. All right, until the next time, which will be tomorrow, uh, I'll be back with a college football free pick and also a major league baseball free pick on Wager Talk TV. Don't forget to give me a like, don't forget to subscribe. Take care and God bless, folks.